Oh, the news just keeps coming on and on and on. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. The day just keeps going and going, bro. Oh my goodness, EDP has been caught once again by my boy Gideon, no less the homeboy himself, Mr. Skeeter Gene Predatory or predatory investigation i don't know how you say that bro but the dude's always got like the coolest band shirts coming on. like i saw him with a oceano shirt the one time i saw him with a a white chapel shirt and then the other day the homie was repping the shirts from the migrant the chosen ones you guys already know the homeboys from shadow of intent i love you ben i see you commenting on my reaction videos shout out to shadow of intent the homeboy is always there bro always there Skater Gene for the win. They got EDP again. How many chances? How many chances are we gonna give EDP? This lock this dude up, bro. Lock him up. Third, fourth, fifth chance. Listen, this is a chance. Judeon confronts EDP 445 in public use after cupcake incident. Y'all remember cupcake gate? Can you even say that five times fast? I can't. It's been over two years since EDP was caught up in a controversy due to a sting operation set up by other YouTubers. They were like, one was like a racist dude, the other one, I don't even know who he is. Looks like a little fuck boy. Fuck that guy. Um, one meant to catch him in the act of being predatory towards minors. Everybody caught that, everybody saw him. Now, Judeon has finally met him in public and confronted the now banned YouTuber, ex TikToker, ex Viner, ex Instagrammer, ex Twitter user, ex user, whatever. Some dude's been banned from everything. He's been banned off the face of the planet. Dude's over on Rumble now. I think he got removed from Rumble too. Who uses Rumble? I only made a Rumble for um, Leafy. Let the record stand. I only made it for Leafy. I'm only following Leafy. Take that with a grain of salt if you will. EDP was a massive YouTuber at one point who had over 2 million subscribers. Everybody remembers this. The Eagles fan base remembers this. Dude was featured uh, on the Philadelphia Eagles Jumbotron for like the pre-game warm-ups, bro. When they went to the Super Bowl and won, he was there. Front row. Paid for. He didn't even buy the ticket. That's crazy. That's crazy to me. Two million subs. And he found success on a platform by posting videos that showcased his explosive personality and crude sense of humor. We all know when he blew up that Chipotle bathroom. What happened? Why can't we get that back, bro? Why do you have to be a freak? Listen. Listen. EDP 445 hasn't dropped completely off the face of the internet since he was banned from YouTube. He's tried to build a new following on other platforms such as, you know, a kick, rumble, uh, Twitter, whatever else is still floating around. However, he still walks free with no legal actions being taken against him, right? Nothing has actually been proven in a court of law that points to him being predatory towards children. Thank you, Dexterto. I just read that word for a word I didn't mean to. I just stole it. This is not a fucking joke, man. I'm just selling at a loss for words. You know, two years ago you were caught kiss my ass in 4K trying to meet a 13-year-old. Really I'm not talking to you. He's talking really to you. My nigga, this is bullshit, man. That y'all pulling right now. It's insane. It's insane. But like, bro, full video coming soon, Jenny. How are you gonna? How are you gonna do this to us, bro? How are you gonna do this? To us? And Skeeter Jean, I gotta see Skeeter Jean's point of view. If you guys don't know who Skeeter Jean is follow his youtube channel i absolutely love the work he does on his youtube it's absolutely insane how many guys he just catches all these he's, he's, he logs everything he a logs the dude basically damn near doxes the dude to get all this guy's information a little fish and bait hook and catch you know what i'm saying whatever that saying is i don't know how it goes so i'm just gonna stop right there when asked about the events that transpired two years ago edp responded kiss my ass and turned towards Jidian, who didn't have any words of sympathy for him Jidian also went live for a little over a minute to brag about catching edp and finally getting an interview from him directly calling out those who didn't think he'd be able to or track the former youtuber down Jidian has yet to release the full video giving more detail about the situation and circumstances in which he found edp guilty and ladies and gentlemen i hope you all enjoyed this one i can't believe the front runner of getting edp behind bars is is stapled with the horseman of the apocalypse Gideon and skeeter gene as death's apocalypse on his side accomplice not apocalypse what the fuck guys i'm out of here hope you guys had a good one see you all in the next one if you guys enjoy these videos subscribe let me know you did in the comment section below <laughs> and I'm, I'm gone